Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Dan from DHTV and today I'm going to be showing you how to install and update iOS 16.1 which should give you the battery percentage. Let's get started. All right, now before you jump into updating, there's a few things you do need to have ready. First, just have a charger on hand and better yet, just plug it up to the charger. It may prompt you if you don't have enough power that you'll need to be plugged in. Make sure you're connected to your Wi-Fi network right there and make sure your connection is as fast as possible and consistent as possible or it's going to take longer. Next, you wanna make sure you have enough storage for this. So you're gonna to go to your general tab in the settings and tap on iPhone storage. It'll pop up letting you know how much free storage you have. I'm assuming you're going to need a few gigabytes. You'll see on screen here what you'll need. Just free up space by deleting photos, apps, and videos. And lastly, it is optional, but it is safe to do so. Back up your device first, just in case something goes wrong, you'll have a backup and you won't lose all of your data. Once you've done all of those things, you can move on to updating your iPhone to iOS 16.1. You're gonna open up the settings here, tap on general, tap on software update. You may have to wait a few seconds here, but you'll see iOS 16.1 appears right there. And you can then tap download and install. It'll prompt you to enter in your passcode, so do so. It may take longer depending on your internet speed and how much stuff you have on your phone already, but you can see an estimate pops up right there. Just give it some time and be patient. All right, so the download process took about 10 minutes for me, and now that we have the software download, we can tap install. Now, during the installation, your device is gonna power down, power back on a whole bunch of times. You'll see the Apple logo appear. Don't remove the charger. Don't turn off the phone. Don't let it die. Don't let anything happen. You're gonna to have to be patient at this point. And once again, depending on the phone you're using, how much stuff you have on it, the installation process may take longer or shorter for you. All right, so the installation for me took only about three to four minutes. And all you're gonna do now is just swipe up, put in your passcode or use Face ID. And now we're just gonna go over a couple of options here. We'll tap continue for the software update. It's gonna let you know that you can use Face ID with a mask now. We'll set that later in settings. Using Hey Siri or using Siri here, you can set that up in settings later as well. Telling you about asking Siri, continue. I don't share my analytics with Apple and then swipe up and you're brought back to your iPhone. And as you can see, the battery percentage is there on my iPhone 12 mini. So that means a lot more iPhones now have support for that battery percentage. If you don't know how to add it there, there's a link in the description to how to add this battery percentage to your iPhone. But you'll have all the new features here like the clean energy charging, live activities for third party applications. So you can see what's going on right on your iPhone and all the new features with iOS 16 and iOS 16.1. If this video helped you, let me know in the comments. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask there as well. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and click the bell notification box to be notified when I post new videos. And as always, I will see you in the next one.